Hey guys, how's it going? I just want to kind of show you all my anamorphic lenses that I'm going to be doing some tests on and some video shoots with. So, um, just kind of get away from social media and all the crazy things that are going on. So, um, the other day I just got in my nice big uh, package D from Rapido actually. And uh, let me tell you, this thing is, um, this thing is huge. Like, it is absolutely huge and it's just amazing. Like, the, the quality of this um, FDV to 35 is phenomenal. I was uh, more than impressed with um, how the images turned up and even at an aperture of like 1.8, everything was sharp. Well, that's because due to this Super Sine Lux uh, lens inside there. Um, I went for the whole package D here. So it came with everything how you see, like it's all ready to go. This is just a cup that goes on the bottom, and then, um, of course, the actual anamorphic lens inside this metal jacket. And let me tell you, the build quality of this thing um, is by far the best I have seen. Um, these have such natural good uh, flares as well as the colors that you can see, like a, a bluish flare. And they are, uh, they're just amazing. It's, it's awesome. Um, I am going to do a comparison. Um, this is from, this is from Rapido Technology. So, uh, let me just kind of focus out on the diopter here so you can kind of see how much it protrudes. There you go. Um, yeah, and this, this, this thing is amazing, and, but it is huge, like, uh, in comparison, here's, like, the SLR Magic Range Finder, and it, it, like, fits inside here, man, like, it, it's, uh, it's absolutely huge, so, there's a comparison with the SLR Magic Range Finder, um, there, so, uh, yeah, um, other than that, yeah, um, this one, uh, this one is from the Anamorphic Store, um, it, it, it is a sign lux and these are compression fittings these are like their compression fittings and they seem to work okay only for this pretty much application for this specific um sign lux lens because it's just it's it's tiny so i mean i wouldn't trust a compression fitting on anything like larger like these isco like no like it's i don't think it's safe so i would rather actually get um I, I don't even like these things from Vid Atlantic either. Um, I prefer the stuff from Rapido here. It's amazing quality. Um, yeah, and the bottom here, this is also a compression fitting as well, so that just pops off. And um, again, like these Schneider Sign Luxes are very sharp. Like they're just naturally sharp. Here's the variable diopter um, from the Anamorphic Store, and here's um, what it protrudes there, if you can kind of see there. Um, it's, it feels cheap, it's almost out of plastic, uh, nowhere near the quality of what Rapido has, so I'm just going to put this back on here. Um, again though, as of now, like, it works, it works, um, as it should, it focuses good, it's fine. Um, yeah, so that's, so then, yeah, so that's that there, okay. Um, let's move over to the range, um... Let's move over to the range finders. Um, I got a couple. Here's here's like an actual 35 mil um, SLR Magic uh, with the two times squeeze. So this obviously you just put on the micro four thirds on the back, and then boom, it's done. So and then you've got your focus ring up here, just like the range finder, okay. And then you got your aperture settings here. So this is pretty much all good to go uh, which is kind of what I like because with these other anamorphics here you have to set up your taken lens and all that so uh, <clears throat> yeah so that's uh, that one there and here's like the anamorphic uh, range finder and the two times um, 50 lens so um, yeah here it is here um, pretty much that's pretty much all it is it attaches on it threads onto here and you got your angle focus gear up here so, I mean, wherever you, there we go. So, yeah. And then I have it on the 50 mil as well. I have the 50 mil attached from SLR Magic. Um, yeah, that's about it. So, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed. I just want to give you a quick rundown. I'm going to be doing some video testing samples after. Um, and, um, yeah. Thanks for watching.